overseas. U.S. President Donald Trump has been criticized for largely ignoring a G20 summit on COVID and going golfing instead. Coronavirus cases in the United States have surged past 12 million, with daily infections setting a new mark. Lauren Lau reports. A record 198,000 new COVID cases were registered in the United States in the past 24 hours, as the country's total infections raised to 12.5 million. Despite a death toll of 260,000, President Donald Trump skipped most of the G20 Pandemic Preparedness Summit and went golfing. The virtual conference, hosted by Saudi Arabia, addressed the search for a vaccine, with members pledging to ensure that less developed countries will not be deprived of a COVID cure. We've seen some encouraging developments on vaccines in the past few weeks, which may offer a path out of the gloom. And the UK has committed to equitable global access for any vaccine. China and Russia offered their vaccines, which are undergoing final stage testing. Trump appeared at the summit's opening ceremony and indicated that U.S. citizens should have priority for COVID jabs. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration has approved emergency use of an experimental medicine that was used on Trump when he contracted the virus last month. Results show that the antibody drug can help fight the virus and reduce coronavirus-related hospitalizations. But demand is expected to outstrip supply. With the holiday season around the corner, health officials advised against Thanksgiving travel. Lauren Lau, HKIBC.